Welcome to another episode of Sydney Adventure Man. I'm here today with Charbels. Say hello, Charbels. Hey, how you go, mate? And we are today heading up to Safala. Thanks to one of my YouTube subscribers, old Toby, who suggested to go to Safala. Uh, we're going to Safala. Uh, it's going to be adventure. Oh yeah, adventure for sure. We're scheduled for a rainy weekend. It's looking quite rainy at the moment. It's all part of the adventure. So we just had another break at McDonald's and it is packed. We are heading to Coles Express Lithco to meet up with Dom and Jake. Jake I have not met yet. Dom, we all know Dom. Let's go. <laughs> And Dom is here. There you go. <laughs> you look like a redneck. <laughs> Where's Jake? So Dom actually slept up at Zigzag by himself. Very <laughs> impressed. He did some lone camping. He followed some tips from a, a Sydney Adventure Man's. Adventure Man always giving tips out. Oh yeah, tippy tips. <laughs> So we've reached a um, water crossing. So at a dom? Yes, we have to wake up, the rain has stopped. And, and the water crossing, water, water crossing. crossing. Yeah, Sharp, you excited? Yeah, first water crossing. We're gonna do it. Actually, I didn't put it in low range. Get up! We've got cows! What do you think of the cows? 100% beef. <laughs> this is a pony. Hello, pony. Hello. Come here. Come here. Come here. Drive, drive through and pat. <laughs> See if he likes the Snickers. Come on. He's got a head like a horse. Cool, man. A bridge with water on it. Yeah. Yeah, 
So we've been driving for a few hours now through the beautiful countryside and whatnots. We're at a place called Waddle Grove. Waddle Grove? Uh, Waddle Street. No, isn't it Waddle Grove? Waddle. Dom's just uh, on a payphone over there uh, to see if we can uh, call Jake because there's no receptions uh, out here in the bush. But, so Mr. Dom, did you get a hold of Jake? Uh, no, he's uh, out of receptions. We've done what I told you. You can't do much more than that. No. Nah. Maybe bake some cakes or something. Bake some cakes. Dom, Dom had some, some cold Tim Tams. They're in his new fridge. Mm. Very nice. So we're stuck on the side of a road and we've had a bit of a flat tyre. It's because of the spoke that I ran over at Roberto's house two years ago. Luckily I've got a bottle of this Uzi stuff. Well, we just took the old one off. Now we just put the new one on. Look at this. You can do it. Come on. Put it in the hole. So we fixed the tire, and no, it wasn't the brand's fault. It was Roberto. It's Roberto's fault. Are we gonna make Roberto pay for it? You can't pay for dumbness. Uh, we just got some receptions, and so we're gonna try and call Jake to see if we can meet up with him, and then we're gonna try and find somewhere to camp. <laughs> Hey, yeah, Shabs. Go. The bunker is in the trees, and the young camper raises his head out of his swag. Thing was under my bunker, and I started banging, saying, "Shut up, shut up!" La 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 long. I like to smoke the bomb. I know, continue singing it forever, just because. Here we are at the cigar part of the trip. Natural watermelons. Growing at Safalas. We have roast beef here. Rambo, first blood. We're chopping up the salami. Hello, Wakba. Ooh. Well, mate. Dom, can you please repeat that? Can you please repeat that? Dom, repeat it. Fit for a king. Yeah? Yes. It's like Krispy Kremes, but the meat. Hello, Wakba. It's the bow to the wild, creeping and crawling, yiggy yes yo, and Snoop Doggy Dog in the motherfucking house like every day, dropping shit with my nigga Mr. Dr. Drake, like I said.